Hey folks, Crazy Climber 80 here again. And this time we're going to look at a game called Jumping Jack, created by Universal in 1984. And this has nothing to do with the uh, calisthenic exercise. At any rate, uh, this is a game in which you're this explorer type of guy, I guess, that jumps from platform to platform trying to reach the goal at either the top left or the top right. And there are different types of platforms. Uh, one is a stationary platform like a rock or a tree stump or something. One is uh, a mushroom that propels you off of the platform quickly. And uh, another is a seesaw. And if an enemy jumps on the seesaw when you're standing on it, you'll be flipped off and killed. And if you jump on the seesaw when the enemy's on it, they will be flipped off and killed. But uh, the enemies just try to knock you off the platforms. And uh, the enemies are primarily monkeys. And there are red monkeys and white monkeys. The white monkeys, well, maybe they're pink monkeys. Pink monkeys and white monkeys. And the white monkeys can help you spell the word extra to give yourself an extra life. But the monkeys, like you, jump. And... Uh, Along the way, you can collect cherries for bonus points. And yeah, if you jump onto a monkey or an enemy, you'll be knocked off and killed. And it's, this monkey is spelled M-O-N-K-Y in this game. English in action. There, I killed a white monkey. And uh, at the top, there's a highlighter, that, and it was on the letter T, so I've got the letter T out of extra. I did not know how to get the extra life until after I've played this game. Now you can see other things to watch out for are boulders. You have to jump over those. This is kind of a strategy game almost. Um, you, your timing is super crucial on when you jump. You don't have to jump always, keep that in mind. Now we go to level 2. And now there's an added uh, danger. Rhinoceroses, rhinoceri, <laughs> uh, will bash the uh, stone platforms to the left. And if you're standing on the stone platform when it bashes it, uh, you're dead. Now, note that you can jump through the monkeys and not die. If they are in the process of jumping or getting ready to jump, you'll survive. And also note that at the end of some of the levels, right at the goal, you might have to jump again towards the goal. If you just jump once, the level won't end. Now we have uh, natives chucking spears. You have to jump over those. If you get nailed by them, you're dead. This game's kind of interesting. Uh, but don't forget that you can't uh, you can't let the monkeys jump on the whoa can't let the monkeys jump on the uh, 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 seesaw while you're standing on it or you're dead. See there, I had to jump an extra time towards the goal to make the level end. So if you didn't jump twice. You just jumped once and there was a monkey waiting there. You die right at the goal, which really sucks. Now we have these piranha that sometimes swim over to chomp at you. And I now have the letters E and T. I didn't I didn't get the extra life on this game, but I'll show you what it looks like. Timing is just super crucial, and it takes... Hoo -hoo. It takes uh, quite a bit getting used to. There are a total of five levels, and then they repeat once you beat them all. This time, you have these weird little platforms that are like little caves. And uh, you'll want to jump through when an enemy's not there. And don't forget, you can jump right through an enemy, or, well, as long as they're a monkey. Now we have these birds that'll fly across, and you'll have to jump at the right time, too. Whoa, just cleared it. Ah, crap, I jumped on a monkey that was on the platform. 
once you go through all five levels, then you play a bonus game and then you repeat all the five levels with harder difficulty. It gets really tough to know when to jump and when to wait. But uh, there's elements from Mr. Do, the most popular uh, game in the Universal uh, uh, Library. Um, there's cherries from the Mr. Do game, and the uh, Extra Life Letters uh, system is from Mr. Do as well. Remember that the mushrooms will propel you right back off. And it's really tough. You have to go through that last uh, cave thing at the right time, otherwise you'll jump right into an enemy. Timing is just so crucial in this game, and it's really hard to get used to. And now we play a bonus slot machine game. You have to jump at the right time to try to make three, three of a kind. And if you do, you get a nice bonus of like 3,000, 4,000, or 5,000 or some. Damn it, but it's really hard to do. There are also the Mr. Do Diamonds. And if you get three of a kind in that slot machine, you get an extra credit. A number of things from uh, Mr. Do in this game. Now the enemies are smarter, they're craftier, they sometimes take their time jumping when normally they would, they would just jump real quick, and it totally throws you off. And don't forget that you can jump through the monkeys as you jump across. Ah, crap. I didn't time that very well, did I? But uh, this game is kind of interesting. Again, uh, to get that extra life, you'll want to uh, kill the white monkey just as the highlight goes over the letter you want. Just, just uh, timing gets really difficult sometimes. I just jumped to avoid that monkey. And then you gotta watch out for those boulders. Ah, crap. There, there were two monkeys on that same rock, and it was too difficult to jump on there without getting killed. Now I'm gonna put in my initials. That is Jumping Jack by Universal in 1984. It's, it's okay can be very challenging <laughs> for uh, for beginners. I'd never heard of this before. Uh, when you when you beat all the levels through, you get a fruit next to your name. And that's what I did. But uh yeah, just remember uh, if you stay still on the seesaw, you better hope that an enemy doesn't jump onto it because if they do and you're standing on it, you'll get flipped off and die. You won't, get, you won't get their middle finger extended at you. You'll get flipped off of the platform. <laughs> Just want to make that clear. Yeah, yeah. If you jump right onto an enemy that's on a flat platform, you'll die. Here's what the extra life screen looks like. If you got the highlight on the all the letters when you kill the white monkey. But that was Jumping Jack by Universal in 1984. Kind of interesting uh, platform strategy jumping game. This is Crazy Climber 80 saying thanks for watching Jumping Jack by Universal in 1984. And I will catch you later in the future with another video. See you then, folks. Bye-bye.